What's up guys, Xenon Zero here, and welcome back to Let's Play Fatal Frame Blind. In the last episode, I got my balls rocked by some kind of boss, and now we found a broken door that won't move. Except for one side. Oh, come on. We're starting off with this. What is going on? What is that sound? Oh, well, that's not that's that's harmless enough. Okay, so there's nothing in there. All right, no big deal. Let's head onwards and continue our trek through this mansion. So we got a brass key. Um, I don't know what that could possibly open. I'm thinking it might open something in this room, maybe. Somebody just went up those stairs. And closed a door. Okay. Weird. That's really weird. Alright, well, what doors were upstairs? What does the clock say? Hey, clock! Do you have an elixir in you? Like an FF6? No? Okay. Let's head up these stairs then and see what we can find. Let's see. The weird chanting has stopped? Because er, last time I came up here there was chanting and now there's not. So that's interesting. There's a black padlock on the door. Use the brass key. Yeah, let's give it a shot. Oh, it worked. Okay. Well, here we are in a. Very dark looking. Oh, this room's neat. What's in here? There's an old book written in charcoal ink on the shelf underneath the urn. Research scrap. Secret rituals of the Hemero family. Oh shit, I skipped one. Alright, you know what? In order to read that, I'm going to go into my file here. Let's see, where is it? Numbers, delirious nonsense. Wait, this thing? Yeah, here we go. Secret rituals of the Himuro family. Many rituals and customs have been passed down through generations of the Himuro family. Most of them are lost. The only things we have left now are some documents that record these rituals as a legend. Hardly any of the oral history remains. This is because all Himuro family members are dead, and those who were close to the family have kept quiet about the ritual. One ritual in particular, performed on December 13th, is shrouded in mystery. People who lived near the mansion stayed inside on that particular day, and even now it is considered bad luck to leave the windows open on that date. I can only assume that this is due to the cruel nature of the ritual, but the truth remains unknown. Cool, and we also have some stuff in the notebook. Let's see. Yes, we do. These are all things I don't think I've actually read yet. So let's go through these quickly. August 20th. Mr. Takamine needs some background material for his next work. There's a book about Himuro Mansion by a certain folklorist, and I'm supposed to, to look for it. A book about Shinto rituals and legends from every part of the country. Author, Ryozo Munakata. Title, Unknown. August 22nd. I couldn't find the book, but I did some checking on the folklorist. I found out he moved into Himuro Mansion to do research on it. But after some certain event, he and his whole family disappeared. I couldn't find the book, but I found a news article from that period about it. It's a small missing person story, but it might be helpful as background material. September 10th, 11 a.m. It looks like the earthquake last month and the murders in that village have something to do with Himuro Mansion. This stuff is probably all going into Takumine's new book. He really seems to be into this subject matter. His output rate should be good. September 10th, 4 p.m. The entrance door is broken. When in the world did that happen? It won't open. I'll have to find another way out. September 11th. I haven't been feeling well since two nights ago. Actually, it's more like ever since Tomoe took my picture. 
What in the world does the rope in this photo mean, I wonder? Now there's another rope. And another rope. September 10th. There seem to be a few devices in this mansion that are engraved with old characters. When I asked Mr. Takamine about them, he said they correspond to numbers. I understand the first few. They're the old characters for the numbers 0 through 3, but I don't get the rest. They're characters that, that have the same readings as 4 through 9, but mean something different. I guess each one has a special meaning. I'll figure out the rest later. And that is everything I believe we have lost, yes. Or have found that is of interest, so sorry for wasting a whole bunch of time reading those. I really wanted to just read them for myself more than anything. Uh, and reading them for you guys also was kind of nice. What's this thing? Looks like an old brassiere. There's so much dust inside that I can't see the bottom. Okay, that's cool. What's this do? You got herbal medicine. Cause you're gonna fight something in this door. That is a door, right? Yeah, it is. Okay. Slow opening doors. There's something in the dark. You got herbal medicine. Is that a person or just like a painting? Or what's going on? You know what? Camera! Tell me what's going on. Oh, it's just ripped, okay. Alright, so this is some kind of courtyard, it looks like. I'll be out here probably later. I love that quick turn. That's the greatest function in any game. Especially in scary games where you're like, I need to run away! Alright, so let's go back inside. Um, oh, this looks new. So that's the rip thing. And there's a door here. Where does this take me? To... Wait, this looks... Wasn't I just here? Wasn't I just here? No, I don't want file. Oh, no. Here we go. Uh... I was, from the looks of it. Maybe. Maybe, I don't know. I don't I don't think I have. So let's just let's go this way. There's a woman at the mirror. Weird. Who's Koji? That's weird. I don't like that. Several pieces of paper on the floor. Looks like part of a notebook. Red notebook scrap. Oh, more reading! The more I find out about Himuro Mansion, the creepier it gets. I'm sure it's the perfect subject matter for Mr. Takamine's next book, but to be perfectly honest, I don't like this assignment one bit. It gives me a bad feeling. There's no way I want to go to that mansion. But it's my job, right? I guess I'll have to go. I wouldn't want to waste the chance to work with Mr. Takamine just because of a little bit of uneasiness, either. It doesn't help that I have the sixth sense for the supernatural, either. There's such a thing as knowing too much, sometimes. I will keep that for later. Let's see, is, is there a save point anywhere in this game, man? Jesus, so far the only one I know of is the one in the beginning of the game. I didn't like that little view change. Herbal medicine, thank you. There's a door. This door is stuck fast. Tried pulling on it, but it wouldn't budge. Okay. That's cool. Let's see. That said, what's this? The same size as the first floor hallway mirror. What do the woman in the mirror mean? I don't know, but I don't really want to find out, so... Let's head down these stairs, then. Yeah, no, this is a new area. This looks very new. Uh... Mafuyu. Is that your brother? Uh, wait. Just... 
Oh, something is coming after me. I don't know what that is, but it's gonna fucking kill me. I don't, I don't like this. It's very Silent Hill-esque. Hello. Alright, so, with that, let's, uh, let's, 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 uh, yeah, let's, let's. Let's load that. And let's take a photo. Oh god, Jesus. Every time that you get grabbed, it's like the most unsettling thing ever. How are you? Please, please go away. Please, Jesus, go away. Get back your child. I don't have your child. I don't have your child. I don't know what you're talking about. Please go away. Alright, you're gonna- you have to come up those stairs, so... I have- I don't have the right film. I don't have the right film. I don't have any film. Oh god. Oh Jesus. Oh god. Alright. Load the film. Where are you? Where are you, skank whore? The music is really unsettling, too. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Inverted camera. I don't like it. Can it not come up the stairs? Haha, <laughs> you don't have legs. You're stuck on the bottom of the stairs. I hate that. That means I have to go down to get it. God damn it. There she is. Come here. Get out. I will kill you. There we go. Got her. Got her. So I don't know what she was, but okay. Oh boy, which ghost was she? In the mirror, where is she? Oh, a man, it was a man? Man with long arms, huh? I'm gonna save that one. Alright, well, that was. Yikes. At least I got it. That counts for something, I guess. Where can I go next? I can go in this room. Which is cool. Let's see what's in here. It's a very open room. Some doors. Some vases. And, uh, something over here. Several pieces of paper. Looks like part of a notebook. God, more reading! September 10th, 8 p.m. I clearly saw the image of a woman in front of the mirror near the entrance. She had long hair and a white kimono. There were ropes tied to her arms and legs, and she dragged them along when she walked. I think I heard Koji talk about something like that, too. There's something very wrong about this mansion. And with that cliffhanger, we're going to end it here. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Let's Play Fatal Frame Blind, and in the next episode, we will continue to scare the shit out of me. Because that's fun, right? Right? <laughs>